Hi guys, I'm going to do some blues this morning. Now, excuse my stuffed up nose, I've still got my throat infection, which I caught, I think, believe from camera person. Yeah. Uh, so I'm, I'm sounding a little bit like a Muppet, but uh, so <laughs> ignore, the, ignore the rather uh, stuffed up nose Blame effect. camera person um, for everything. Yeah. Yes. I don't know what it is, but anyway, I'll get rid of it soon, but excuse <laughs> the uh, rather muffled uh, uh, sound effects. So what I want you to do is, come over here to the left hand camera person. What I want you to do, this is a great little... Um, blues boogie left hand and what I want you to do you all know how to play the chop right that's the chop which I think practically everybody who watches these videos can play but what I want you to do is just add in an extra note so you've got the chord of G and I want you to play this it's kind of really great chunky blues left hand so this is basically it for this leg what I wanted to do, particularly if you're a novice or a total beginner, make it really simple. Just play two notes, play the fifth and the seventh, and do it in time to the left hand so your coordination isn't too challenged. So do something really simple like this if you're a beginner. So... That, that doesn't sound very bluesy, you know, but it will get your hand coordination in sync, you know. So once you pra practice that for a week and you, can, and you can do that, then you can sort of do more advanced stuff. Um, but the thing is to get the basics right. So do make sure you can get that left hand and do that trill. And once you've got that sort, then you can start sort of improvising with the blues scale, which we did in the last lesson, stuff like this kind of, you know. <laughs> left hand. So the main thing for this lesson is to get that left hand, get that chunky left hand, and get that very simple right hand trill going with it. And then once you've kind of mastered that and you can play it perfectly hands together, uh, then start putting the blue scale over it. I did the blue scale in the last lesson, I might put a link to it so that you can revise the blue scale. Um, and as always, if you can read sheet music, uh, do make sure if you're following this lesson, you're a subscriber, that you do have the Badass Boogie Bundle. The price has been frozen down for the past, I think, five years. We, we, we keep saying we're going to update the website. Uh, but if you want the frozen prices, now is the time to get them. Uh, we haven't raised our prices now for years. They're still at the, the sort of... Uh, uh, 1876 prices so if you want to take advantage of that do go out to our website and put an icon there or look at the description and print out the bundles they're a pdf download each bundle is about 130 pages of world-class boogie boogie sheet music and you're going to be playing in a matter of hours rather than uh, years when you have the sheet music in front of you so do go to our website and get the boogie boogie sheet music uh, press that subscribe button press that like button and i will talk to you very soon, soon.